So, welcome back to Hollow Knight, everybody. We are at 101%, so that's pretty cool. We have done more than enough, but apparently there's still a bit more. At the very least, there is the arena. And it, I know I said I wasn't going back there, but now that we have the final nail upgrade... Oh, that's right, final nail upgrade. We gotta track down the uh, the nail forger guy, because apparently he left somewhere else. I'm gonna see if he's with the other nail forgers, if I can remember where they are. We could try the arena, now that we have the final nail upgrade, if we're able to kill most of those enemies in the arena in one hit. Then I might be tempted to give it another try. If not, though, then probably not. And, of course, there are more Zoat fights, I suppose, but, I mean... Do we do we really want to keep doing the Zoat fights? I kind of don't. Uh, let's see. That should be, that should be. Actually, no, we don't We don't need Quick Slash. Not for common enemies. I think I'll equip the Mark of Pride. And we'll get Spider Friends. I cannot one-shot Primal Aspids, unfortunately. Hmm, that's a shame. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to go over there. I want to take the tram. I'm not sure if Zote ever will give up, though. He seems like one of those guys who just won't change. But, eh, who knows. I think there was a nail guy up here in the clouds. Hi, DX! Nice to see you. Welcome, welcome. You haven't missed anything yet. We're just making the game plan. I'm, I'm trying to visit all the nail masters to see if the uh, guy who forged my nail is hanging out with them. Boop, 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 boop. Also, my plan, so... It would be nice if I could finish up Hollow Knight this week. My main reason being, if I finish up this week and Wednesday stream, I'll be at a nice round 30 streams, which is just such a beautiful number. But at the very least, even if it takes longer than that, I am finishing this up this month. Because by September, we are playing the Pekar Baseball. I'm itching to play it again. Uh, I think the Nailmaster bro is down here? Green Path Halloween Cliffs... The other is with the falling bodies, eh? Hey, dude. Got that nail art, the dash slash, learnt from my brother Oro, was it not? So he is still alive, then. Hmm, I still haven't forgotten what he owes me, and I never will. Oh, I'm sorry, I shouldn't bother you with such things. I'm happy that you were able to train under another Nailmaster and grow stronger, my pupil. Alright, well, he's not here. I am, too. Because, while I get final say in all the players, I oftentimes do have Twitch chat help me decide. Usually I pick half the players, and Twitch chat helps me pick half the players. Which, uh, makes it very interesting. So if you've never been part of a Backyard Baseball stream before, you should definitely join in for the first one, because then you help get a say in who my team is. Yeah, it's going to be fun. But, that will be a discussion for when we actually play Backyard Baseball again. That's right, your birthday is tomorrow. Happy early birthday, DX. Got any fun plans for the birthday? Ah, here we go. I'm like, where's the exit? There the exit. Zoom! Might go to a Japanese restaurant. That's fun. It's always fun to go out to some place uh, fun to eat on your birthday. Personally, I'm a fan of going out to barbecue restaurants on my birthday, but I also like meat a lot, so... <laughs> Alright, Green Path is where another one of the Nail Guys is, and then also in the, uh, the Far Off Kingdom. We'll save the Far Off Kingdom one for the end, because then we can also check out the arena and see if... We want to try beating that third arena round. I know! You don't have to explain Arthur references to me. Unless it's from one of the newer episodes. 
In which case, yeah, I don't know about those. Uh, I think he's over by the bench down from here. <laughs> Spider friends were just beating that guy up up there. That was great. Alright. Yeah, I think the Nail Master is this way. Oh yeah, it's this way I kept going. Uh, okay, no. Ow, my bottom. Let's try this again, but without the spike death. Ah, yes. That's what you really want for your birthday. Well, I I will try to oblige. Ow, my face. Oh, that's not fair. <laughs> I mean, it is, but also... <sighs> Yikes. I can cheat by going on Google. Oh, here they are! They're making arts and crafts together! Oh, this is fun! Oh, look who's joined us! We have quite a merry crowd now, don't we? This fellow came wandering into my hut quite distraught and on his own quest for a new calling in life. We talked and found a common love of creating and building and honing a craft, so now we make art together. <laughs> it's good to have company. I hadn't realized how lonely I was. It's like being with my brothers again. Stay with us if you like. <laughs> How's your macaroni art going? Uh, hmm. Oh, hello, traveler. How strange that we should meet again in a world as vast as this. I must thank you for not killing me when I asked you to. I was irritated at first, but I had some time to think up there, and I soon saw the wisdom in your decision. This world is made of more than metal and weapons. I set out exploring and soon found my way here. Shio is a master of many arts, and he has promised to teach me what he can. I think I'll be quite happy here. Happy couple. Nothing like two bros making macaroni art together, huh? Whee! Ouch. <laughs> hey, Nintendo Addict, welcome. It's always nice when someone finds a new calling in life. It is true. It is Big Bird. Alright. So, let's see. Consulting the map again. I'm trying to re I'm trying to think if there's anything left to do outside of the arena at this point. Oh yeah, I've got the quick warp to the arena set as well. That's fa that's just fantastic. I don't think there's much else outside of the arena in the Zoot fight, so... Hmm. Alright. I always forget which button it is, so... Dream Gate, you hold down to set it, and you hold up. Okay. I always get those two confused, and I accidentally overwrote one of my warp point at one time, which was terrible. All right, I I told I swore I would never go back here, but I have upgrades now. We got to figure out what's the most important badges to equip. Not that, not that. Okay, definitely unbreakable strength, no question. That is being equipped. Um what else? Mark of Pride is also really good because of its long reach. The soul recovering ones are decent. I don't think Baldur's Shell is really worth it. Alright, Mark of Pride is... A, I think that's a must. That or just the Lone Nail. Because Quick Slash is also good. 
Quick Slash is also very good. I could go with Quick Slash and Steady Body, maybe. <laughs> Just go the pure physical build? Yeah, I like this. Because if we're good, we don't need to heal ourselves. Alright. <laughs> well, I'm a fool to come back here, but... I don't know what... I don't know what much else we could do here. This, it's very fitting this is called the Trial of the Fool, because you would have to be a fool to try and beat this. We fought Zote a lot recently, so... Maybe break it up a little bit. We. Thank you, thank you. I thought it was pretty hilarious as well. Alright, now here's hoping that we can kill these guys quickly. Okay, I like that. We can kill him really quickly. Oh, yes. Okay, these guys still take two hits. I don't like that. Oh, man, most of these guys still take the same amount of hits. No! No! And the guys still spawn on top of me. Yeah, I don't think this is going to be any easier at all. Those guys might be a smidge easier. Oh, look, I got stuck under there again. I'm missing another piece of heart, and I'm also missing some badges. I bet the piece of heart is in just a random spot that I easily could have gotten a while ago, and I just never found it. Oh, that's right, stupid bats. I do like this badge setup. It's very physical attack based, but considering that's most of the attacks in Hollow Knight that you end up doing, or that I end up doing, I think it works well. I also think Steady Body is a great value in here. You, it only costs one notch, and it's quite useful. How is it he always manages to shoot his blasts in between the gaps. I just don't get it. <laughs> yep, true. No no way of knowing where the mask shard is. Oh, really? I don't think so. Okay, that's where the hero's pride really comes in handy. It's the super long reach is just fantastic. Yeah, all these guys still take the same amount of hits, even after the nail upgrade. So, like, what was the point of the nail upgrade? Oh, did I call it, can we finish this week? Yeah, that is not proper grammar. I meant, I meant to say, can we finish this week? That's right, this doofus. 
There we go. The Soul Catcher would be a good one to have as well. Just so I could heal a bit more. But the thing is, later on in the arena match, you can't heal even if you want to, because you're just stuck in midair. Rats. Alright, don't heal because that guy appears. I remember that. Okay, those guys take a one less hit. That's great. Oh, that was almost perfect. Wait, how is he not dead? Don't have enough soul apparently to heal myself all the way. This part of the arena just sucks. You pretty much need Mark of Pride for this. Remove the spikes. I don't like where this is going. I hate how random these guys are. Still alive, for now. Knock it off. That guy, we can heal safely while he's on screen. This is this is actually good. Hey, Mobius. Sorry, I'm not really able to read chat right now. A lot's happening. <laughs> Hooray! All right. Not bad, but oh, the big challenger, the challenger, God Tamer. Oh, please. Sure enough, they, they, they put in a huge boss at the end whose pattern you're not familiar with. And if you want to know his pattern, you have to just play the arena a whole bunch. And of course, it hit me the frame before I get to heal. Sure, why not? Why do they put an annoying boss at the end of, like, 800 arena challenges that you're going to fail to, so you ha 
This is very stupid. This is very stupid. Hmm. That better have been the end. Sure, you can give a couple tips if you want. That better have been the last fight that I died to. If there's more after that... Not good. Oh, that's right! Oh, we should have equipped this. Allowing us to move while healing. That, that actually would be really good. I definitely like the Mark of Pride. We kind of need that. Combine that with the Shape of Oon, and maybe the... No, we don't need the Lone Mail as well. We already have that. Maybe Soul Catcher? That and Soul Catcher together could be good, but... Because we can't afford Quick Slash as well. I can get Soul from Dream Nailing Enemies. It's particularly useful on the vertical Garpedes in the No Floor section. Oh, just before the no floor section, when you have just the shielded fool left and you're trying to heal up. I... you can get soul from that? I did not know... I'm not sure if I ever knew that. I mean, that lets you get soul from it, but... hmm. Why do I get the feeling my reward for this... oh wait, no, 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 we got it get our shadow back before we go in the hot springs. Why did he only take one hit? Am I just that powerful now? You get a third of his soul vessel normally and two thirds of the dream wielder. Okay. I never use the dream nail on enemies because it's really, really, really slow. And the enemies will like always hit you before then. Alright, I'll try it. Yes, yes, thank you, thank you. Now we'll see how much I regret not including Quick Slash. Already kind of regretting it. I do love being able to move with the, uh, while healing. That is really nice. Definitely feeling like there's just too much stuff on screen. So much, though. How many tries will it take to get for the arena? Probably quite a few. Thank you, Shadow Dash. It's annoying because so often I get hit by these guys when they're off screen, and it's like, oh, you jumped, so they hit you now. It's like, how was I supposed to know there was one heading towards me at that angle, though? Because they were off screen, and they can move ridiculously fast.
Aha! Aha! Yes, very, very good. Ouch! I hate the shotgun bug in this room because he always just flies out of reach. Hardcore parkour! Wait, how did you not die? Or is that a new one? I'm digging the extra soul I have with the Soul Catcher. There's a reason Soul Catcher is one of my favorite charms. I don't understand what causes those guys to spawn in. Okay, that's rude. It's also rude to just spawn in enemies right where I'm trying to be. Ah! I always get stuck under the platforms. <sighs> right, let's just get rid of you before you cause any more trouble. Yeah, the crowd likes that. Yeah, the Dream Nail just takes an eternity to use, man. I also hate this enemy right here. No! I'm so sorry to hear that, Proxima. Eat when... Wait, can you dream nail these guys? Oh, you can dream nail these guys? I did not know that. That's really good. Kill hurt. I am so sorry, Proxima. That's... That freaking sucks. I thought you were saying use the dream now on the weird, the shielded fool guys. Oh no. This is one of my least favorite waves in the arena! I don't like that part of the arena. I don't like any part where you was like, oh, let's have you fight 50 enemies without ever getting a chance to heal yourself. Oh, <laughs> yuck. I definitely like being able to move, though, while healing. That's, that's going to be pretty nice. Maybe we should go hunting for the last mask part. If people want to pull up a list of the mask parts... 
And if you see any where it's like, oh, I don't think Artie's gotten that one, and you want to read it to me, I'll see if it, I uh, remember. But what's ultimately going to happen is I'll be like, I don't remember which ones I've gotten. <laughs> I don't remember which ones. You say visit Hollow Knight? Sure, let's let's do that. Cause I have I would have absolutely no clue where the last mask shard is. I need to remember that there are walls over here. I like walls. They keep us safe. Because we can jump over enemies with those. Hey, bro! Oh, that's right. If there's just one shotgun bug, it's not too bad. But when you get a bunch of shotgun bugs all together in one place, it, the party becomes a rager. Oh no! Oh no, you're gonna blow up. Ooh, I parried. No! Ah! Don't let the explosive bats in the arena. These guys be a little less random. Sincerely, everybody who played this arena. And it's like, you'd think, like, oh, I'm right under this platform in the center. Surely nothing could, like, get me here. <laughs> That's where you're wrong. Wait, we didn't do child fishing. That must be where the piece of heart is. Oh, double prizes. Oh, this little jerk butt! Every time I get close to him, he moves farther away. Ouch. Kids, don't be a jerk butt. Everybody you interact with will thank you. Including your future self. Why, yes, you will be interacting with your future self on a regular basis. In fact, I roomed with my future self in college. He always warned me not to go on dates with specific girls, that it would never work out. Maybe the reason they didn't work out is because he warned me they wouldn't work out. That's an idea I had for, like, a show slash, like, short story. Guy goes to college, and his free roommates are just himself from different time periods in college. If it was a TV show, I'm not sure if it would make it past the pilot, but... It's at least a unique idea. I hate how the little ghosty boys can just spawn in the air during this phase. How is this guy hitting me if I'm not above him?
Oh. Quit being a coward. I'm not taking full credit for that idea. My brothers helped me. This is great. Whoa, I just got a whole bunch of soul from that one. Alright. It's time for the worst part. Okay, charge shot on this area actually works great. Um, doesn't work great here, but also nothing great really works here. Help! What the heck? Oh, I hate this. That part is so unfair. Alright. Uh, oh, that's not where the bench is. <laughs> okay, well. Let's go hunting for the mask shards. They're also... Like, one of these badges I get from the badge guy, once I get these two badges. Don't know where these two badges would be. This one might be similar to Quick Focus, which could be really nice to have. Hmm. First place I should look is the Royal Waterways. Okay. Yeah, if people want to nudge me in the right directions for the charms, that would be great. Who knows? Maybe, maybe one of the remaining charms that I don't have would help me out in the arena. Maybe. Probably not. Royal Waterways. Okay, now we want to head over here for the City of Tears. Mask Shard first. That sounds like a good idea. Extra Mask Shard will also help me with the Zote fight. Wait, I remember there's spikes on this side for no reason, other than to catch people off guard. The elevator always takes you in the wrong direction to begin with. Like, always. Why? Oh, hey, it actually took me in the right direction. I have gotten hit by those spikes more times than I care to admit. Alright, do do. Where's the nearest way to the Royal Waterways? Okay, it's way over here. We don't want to go to Ancient Basin.
I think I could beat the arena fight if it let me equip all of the charms. That should be what they do, like, hmm. That's what I would think they should do on, like, a low... On a minimalist run, like, if you're not upgrading your nail or getting the mask shards or, the, like, the soul upgrades, you should be able to equip the, the badges for free. Kind of like what uh, Pro Paper Mario Pro Mode did with their level 1 run. I think that would be a good idea. For those of you who are crazy enough to try a minimalist run of this game. Uh, the question is, where in here shall we check? Well, let's, let's go down first. You guys are freaking relentless. Oh, lord. Alright, maybe the mask shard will be here somewhere. Oh, that's right, this is where all the maggot stuff was. Through there is the area where we fought the maggot cane. I don't think I necessarily want to go back there again. <laughs> Maybe they found stock sounds from a library. Really? He just perfectly went his way over there. Okay. Wait a bit. No, oh, that was str that was weird. Oh, that's where I came in from. Oh, I see. Whee! One man's trash is another man's treasure. You're still alive. I don't think you should be. You know, hey, money is money, so if, if you get paid to make gagging noises, nothing wrong with that. That's not one of those jobs you should be ashamed of. Yeah, okay, I didn't think it would be in the maggot room, but I had to check. Let's not go back there again. Maggot Mom, aka a bug. Oh, that's right. Weirdo McBeardo is here. Yeesh. How did the fight go? I lost. And I'm gonna return once I get the remaining badges and the, uh, ooh, free money. And the last mask shard. Nothing else? Really? Oh. The symbol key location is in the Royal Waterways. Is it now? I forgot about the simple key. Well, I have no clue where to look for that. Is it on the right half? 
of the Royal Waterways by chance. Oh, a new opening. Interesting. Probably not your best decision. Maybe it's in the junk pit, and I just didn't know. I forget when the last time I went to the junk pit was. I've got the power! Yeah, believing in me is not necessarily the best decision you can make. <laughs> I'm flaky. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I've been to the... Oh, that's right! Was it here? Use the simple key. What could go wrong? Is this going to be another spirit battle? Oh. Collected the God Tuner, device that resonates with beings of great power. Seek the gods of hollowness. Tune their power through their strength. Ascend. Uh-huh. So am I to assume that we can now enter a big dream? Now where is this? Agrabah? Blasphemy! Rank blasphemy! Thou crawler! Thou cringer! Thou smallest of the small! By what right dost thou trespass here, in this home of the gods? Shrivel away and be gone. Be gone. I think you're committing the blasphemy. You're saying gods plural. Oh, is this another bonus dungeon like Buzzsaw Land? I like the art style. Yoink. God home. I don't think so. Hey. Our mind to see. <laughs> I know they're bugs. Ooh. Challenge? Uh. Pantheon of the Master. Seek the gods of nail and shell. Huh? What? I'm confused. What does it mean by bindings? Is this like no nail, no shell, no charms, no soul? I'm not binding anything. We're gonna begin. I don't know if binding something is good or bad. Wretch, thou hast ordained thine own destruction. Through sacred combat are we attuned to this kingdom's greatest beings. By entering this gate thou hast challenged the very gods of this kingdom. Dost thou consider thyself the equal of this pantheon, of its masters? Draw thy weapon then, fool of fools, and be damned for thy arrogance. Wait... The Vengeful King, or the Vengefly King. I fought this guy in the arena. Oh, there's a pit there. Apparently. Did you have given me, like, maybe a bench before this? That could have been nice. I mean, this doesn't seem so bad. I'm messing up a lot, but that's just on me. Being unprepared. Yeah, that wasn't too bad.
The Grud Smuggler. Okay, so there's more than one fight. That was easy. Again, I fought that guy before. Be prepared! What next? Oh my gosh! False Knight! It's been ages! Wow, you are a lot easier now. Oh my gosh, Quick Slash wrecks him. Did I know I can dream battle him? Maybe? I'm braver than all of you! The Massive Moss Charger? I don't remember this one. This must have been one of those nondescript bosses that I just don't remember very well. That was it? Why is shipping for a CD costing $14? I don't know. Oh, it's Hornet! I really like this fight. This is the first Hornet fight. I kind of wish they did more with Hornet in this game. She seemed that she was building, she was being built up like she was going to be a second main character, but she definitely was not. Reoccurring character, yes, but we also never really learned her deal. There are a bunch of doors here, so if these doors are all different boss rushes, then I assume Lost Kin will reappear. But this time, I may be ready for him. Oh, hey! This is nice of them to give me a hot springs. And a bench! Of my very own. Cool, we don't need the Wayward Compass. Uh, I will take... Well, for one notch... Probably Steady Body or Grub Song. I mean, there aren't a whole lot of other good ones for just one, so yeah, we'll take Steady Body. I don't know how this game can be this long, to be honest. Now it's night. It's Gorb! I forgot about the spirit battles. Wait. Oh, I fell off a cliff. I'm like, I didn't get hit by Gorb. Sorry, Gorb. You put up a good fight, but sorry. Ascend with Gorb. Ah! Uh, I fought you in the mine, didn't I? Oh no, this is Dun Defender. I'd say healing's gonna be tough. But if I can knock the bosses down, it won't be. Oh, Buster! I have no idea how many bosses we're going to have to fight this way, but. I'm 
guessing it will be most of them. If they throw Nightmare King Grim into this, though, then probably not going to happen. Ho, ho, ho. Oh, poop puns. Wait, this guy was a boss, not just a common enemy? So they put bosses just as common enemies in the arena, because of course they do. Okay, this guy does have a lot more HP than the arena version did. Oh, and this guy as well. You know what should happen? If you defeat every enemy in the game and get all their records, I hope my ex-wife becomes the final boss. <laughs> this is clearly a boss gauntlet. Oh, looks like we made it to the end, though. Why hast thou crept into this pantheon, O meager one? The noise of thine wriggling creates much discord, drowning out the godly resonance we attune ourselves to. Dost thou mean to thwart our sacred goal? Dost envy drive thou to such madness? We pray that the gods of this kingdom punish thee, obliterate thee, utterly destroy thee. Sir, this is a Wendy's. O oh, gods of Hollow Nest, show us your might. We shall attune ourselves to thee and ascend ever higher. I was just looking for the bathroom. Heal in that room before going on. Whoops. Yes, Whoops. Neo, Nail Master Oro. We need strategy when we have cheese. Oh ho, Brother Zoro and Mato. fight. Uh-oh. Thank goodness the heal got off in time. Oh, well, well. There was no bench in that last room. Oh, you have to do the entire thing again? How many doors are there? Okay, there's three doors. So three different boss rushes? Seek power. Yeah, that's not going to um, satisfy you in life, though. I don't remember fighting the nail guys at all. I'm guessing the last one is going to be just the nasty bonus bosses. Okay. Quick Slash is really good. It really is. But I think we can do just with Lull Nail, and this way we can get Shape of Oon to heal a lot easier. And then we can try that again. You don't fight them in the overworld? What the heck? What the heck does this mean? I don't know what this means. Does this mean binding soul means you, like, can't get soul? You can't equip charms? You can't... Uh, I don't know what this means. I'll try binding all of them, but I think I'm about to find out the hard way. The bindings make it harder in different ways. It's optional. Well, shoot. Let's see what happens here.
Oh, see, okay, so I can't have, I don't have as much HP, or I can't heal as much HP. And then my soul, oh my gosh, I can only use one heal at a time. That's really stupid, that's really bad. Gotta rely on the kids to beat this guy for me. This music might be a little bit too epic for just a slightly larger flying bug than is what is expected. Okay, I'm doing way less damage. That must be what the nail binding does. Oh no, I just have way less. I'll uh... oh, forget, forget this. Forget that, I'm not I'm not doing it with all these bindings. Yeah, forget forget that. So that's literally just an extra challenge. Am I really going to attempt I'm not I'm not committing to beating them all, but I'm at least going to see what they're at what they're about. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> Way faster that time. I wonder if it's the same order of bosses each time. It seems like it. False Knight is hilarious to play with the quick slash ability. <laughs> Great shell, it belongs to me! <laughs> Sorry, False Knight. You're cute and all, but you are very easy. <laughs> I still think False Knight's head looks like a puppy. Massive Moss Charger! Oh, OBS disconnected because of course it did. Why did it disconnect though? I still have internet. <laughs> what the heck? No, no, now I don't. Of course. <sighs> I need a new PC that doesn't disconnect from the internet when you get just slightly too warm. Oh, I need a new PC. One that's not portable. One that is solid and fast. 
and efficient and cool. One that I can't take with me to school. Oh, I need a new PC. One that's more reliable as me. I need more RAM. But I guess this one's just fine as I am. Oh, I need new ROM. Because right now I'm just saying, come on. If only I had more ROM, then at last I could take them on. I wish I had a better fan so that I could stand to stream a while. But no, it has to overheat and now I cannot beat this game. Oh, I need a new PC! It's as beautiful as me, that's got a great IP. It must be great to see, oh, I need a new PC, and then... We oh, shoot, we're back. Oh, uh, you didn't hear anything. <laughs> My PC overheated again, and I was lamenting that I didn't have a better one. Hornet's theme is great. I love I love flute music. <laughs> this is one of those fights where uh I could actually potentially do it no damage. Wow, I did do it no damage! Okay, is there seriously not a bench here? Oh no, there is a bench here, so I can change up my equipment if I want, but I don't think I want. No, my computer did not crash, it just thought it was getting too hot, and it's like, Ah! Too hot! Turn off the internet! Immediately! Because, I don't know why. The thing that I'm worried about, though, folks, this is the first door. Presumably this is gonna be the easiest of the boss rushes. If that last door has, like, it's the Lost Kin, the hard Zote fights and Nightmare King Grim all together. I'm like, great. And maybe some of the hard spirit battles. Bye, Gorb. All right, now it's time for the poop smith. You are so done, man. Oba doba. Oba doba doba. Let's just keep stun locking him. Quick slash just breaks so many of these fights, and I love it. Quick slash basically lets you deal double damage. So good. Ho ho ho.
Epic music for the frog bugs. I still think these guys look like frogs. It's the mouths, I think. Alright, so far so good. This is where our things started taking a turn. I just realized saying nice job is basically like the meme of Obama putting the medal on Obama, which is easily one of my favorite meme templates. Oh, hey! Hello. Oh, that's right. I already talked to you. You're just being condescending. Okay. Hey, dude. Okay. This time I'm not just going to be like, oh, I don't care if I take a hit. Music here is so good. <laughs> this is such a cool fight, though. The two nail brothers. So, is this fight exclusive to the arena or to the, like, boss rush area? Because, again, did not ever play this in the uh, main game. Thank you, uh, Sonic. Thank you so much for the resub. I am so in danger right now, so I can't uh, read stuff, but thank you, fam. I also saw that you were playing Oracle of Ages last night. If it wasn't so late at night, I definitely would have joined in for that. Also, come on. Like, one of these guys should be dead at this point. There we go. There we go. <laughs> oh, you were trying to distract me just like I distract Shaggy when I subbed to him. <laughs> So proud. Brotherhood! Oh! That was the end! Time, 8.43. <laughs> the, I, I was so blown away by those words of wisdom that I didn't know how to react. Alright! Well, we cleared the first boss rush without too much difficulty. Cool. Unfortunately, I'm sure this means that much more horrifying things wait beyond these other challenges. The path of the artist, seek the god-inspired. Yeah, I'm not binding anything. I go in on my own merits. Yeah, we're fighting basically all the bosses in the game over again. But this time we've got advanced equipment, so they're a lot easier. But we have to do them all in a row. Thou most ungrateful of blemishes! The gods, in their great mercy, allow thee to escape their first pantheon alive. Yet still thee think to test thine self against their might. Doom thyself then, that we may resume our focus and ascend our minds even higher. These people seem very full of themselves. It's zero! I remember this. I think he was like the first spirit battle I fought. At least one of them. Oh, darn it. Oh, da. Oh, go back. Oh, go back. Yeah, that extra... That extra attack power is really helping out. <laughs> well, tell Liam I said hi. <laughs> also, I have never seen the scene movies, but I hope that they are good. Oh, it's it's this guy who like I could have fought way earlier in the game than I actually did. 
How wonderful. So are they just bringing these guys back to life? Oh no, it's Mega Teleporting McGee! The guy who I fought with really low equipment for some reason. Oh yeah, because I'm stubborn and I didn't find this, the other stuff earlier. I should have healed during that. Whoops. Okay, now he breaks the ground and we have the second phase, right? <laughs> this guy's a little melodramatic. Yeah, I remember this part. The second phase being a little harder than that. The obble blobbles. I don't remember these. I don't remember. Oh no, I do remember this fight. Don't remember where I fought them. There we go. Hey, I could go for a checkpoint right about now. Oh, it's the Mantis Bros! Another fight that I didn't face until way later than I probably should have. Oh no! My butt! Ah, uh, good old Shadow Dash. Reliable as always. Oh my gosh. As a worm, I'm too short for them to hit. That's so f good. Ugh. Please keep doing this over and over again. I'm definitely liking the, uh, the badge setup I have going. It's helping me out a lot. Oh, that's right. I remember this weird spirit, where you have to basically play a game of volleyball. Oh, that was a lot easier than I was anticipating. <laughs> that was easier than I thought it would be. Nosk. Oh, this is the guy who uh, pretended to be me, right? Oh, I just realized, guys, we may have to face the catcher again. The one who had all the glass bottles. Man, 
Man, this guy's annoying. Well, we barely made it out of that one alive. Flukeworm. Oh, it's the Maggot Queen. Alright, but you've got a second phase. I remember that. Wait, no, you don't have a second phase? No, you have a second phase! Okay, th this is not the Lost Kin. This is just the Broken Vessel. Not as hard. I still have a lot of that muscle memory from the Lost Kin again. That's not the Lost Kin, that was the Broken Vessel. That was the easier version of it. Yeah, I must- I still have the Lost Kin muscle memory for a lot of those attacks. Cause I- I didn't even remember his pattern, but yeah, it was just there. Hey. Ah! Will the gods not relieve us of this troublesome speck? How it tests us, seeing this worm raise its filthy weapon to the gods. Thou hast luck beyond luck, O oh speck. The gods of this pantheon, for purpose beyond our understanding, allow you amongst them. Truly, the divine punishment they must be planning for you will be beyond all reckoning. Prepare thyself. Prepare thyself. I... I... I was just told that I could get Beatles tickets here. Hi! Paintmaster Shio. I don't remember you. Yeah, okay, no, this is new. This is new, 100%. You've got a lot of range. Okay, and I don't know any of your patterns. Okay, yellow means you're gonna be doing a huge dash. That will shoot stuff forwards. a very interesting fight. Okay, if you jump in the air, you're going to be using red. Usually. This is a fun fight. I dig the artsy feel of it. Oh, he was easier than the guys in the first, uh, Pantheon. One colorful art master against the other. Inspiration! That was easier than the first... Pantheon. At least, I never died to that one. Well, I'm on fire! I'm going to sit on the bench before this one. This is the one I'm not sure about. Because if this is what I think it is, this is where we're going to face the Lost Kin. Pantheon of the Sage, seek the god of wealth and power. <laughs> I also have, like, basically everything in the game at this point. I also have the quick... Quick Slash is really, really, really good against bosses, from what I'm seeing. <laughs> Lowly brute! Blindest of worms! Again thee challenge the gods! What divine whim has granted thee the strength to endure their presence where no others may stand? Fight then, struggle then, and keenly shall we listen for thy destruction! <laughs> it's the Hive Knight! Unfortunately, now that we're getting back into the tough bosses, I think this is where me luck runs out. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. This is the. These are the boss fights that. Uh, these are the ones that are going to truly challenge me. And that was the first fight, and I died to it. I'm hoping they don't dip into the bonus bosses here. Even though a lot of these bosses, I think, technically are bonus bosses. Please keep doing this attack. Okay. Ah, no worries. No worries. Soup is more important than my stream. No question. Elder who? Elder, huh? You must face the Elder. <laughs> elder who? Exactly. Collector, not the catcher. This is gonna be a tough one. Although the fact that I can now take out the enemies that it summons in a single hit is definitely going to be very helpful. I was like, that can't be it. <laughs> Don't dash into the collector. Well, that was a lot easier the second time. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I remembered that. <laughs> yeah, we've just beat my aunt. Oh, hey! It's it's the god tamer in the arena battle that I didn't actually beat. I'm not really sure what the pattern for this fight is. Looks like your pet is doing more stuff than you are. I hate how every time I heal myself, they immediately hit me again. That stinks. Ravioli. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's try that again. I wonder if you get anything special for beating all of these with max bindings. I'm not going to do that, because that would not be fun.
be night. More like good night. Haha. <laughs> I did get the free. <laughs> I'm definitely not doing these out of order. Alright, Garfield. This spirit reminds me of Garfield. It's the coloration and the cat paws. Garfield monk bug, yeah. I hate Mondays and Paige slash Peter Fox. <laughs> I don't even remember what started the whole like, oh, the collector is my aunt. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm I'm down for it. Sorry to hear that, Prox. Hopefully this stream makes it a little bit brighter. Okay. You... Fools. Okay. I hate how far he launches the acid snot. That's not very nice. Okay. This guy doesn't seem to do much. He slashes with his knife when he lands on the ground. And it seems like that's it. Come on! Oh, you can't just land your butt on my face. You can't do that! Okay, you really can't do that. You can't do that! What the heck? <laughs> How are you even supposed to challenge that? They just spit everything everywhere. I gotta get, I gotta get rid of his freaking his pet. But maybe it's like a Clayton and the Stealth Sneak fiend, where if you take out Clayton, that fiend dies too. Probably not, but could be. What the? Look for the bare necessities. Oh, you're not supposed to be able to do that. You are welcome to share suggestions. I'll use the soul attacks on the, the guy.
Man, I'm, I'm just loving getting to dunk on these bosses that gave me so much trouble earlier. Okay, so that guy just always lands where you are, so you just gotta be ready to avoid him. And <laughs> then I just wait there for him to land on me. I was about to say, how is that guy not dead? There we go. There we go. Which character from A Bug's Life is this dude? Uh... Seems like a thumper. Oh, oh it's just regular Grim. Okay. I do not remember his pattern at all. I remember that one. I can't believe I didn't take damage from that. <sighs> Should have healed there. No, oh, man. There's more stuff down here. Interesting. Seeker of Gods. There's a door down there and a ominous looking door over here. Hall of Gods. Mm hmm. Hmm. I don't like how Lost Kin and the Nightmare King are both listed on here. The Gruz Mother. Oh. This is where you can individually challenge them try and get better at them. I see. This is what you were hinting at, Proxima. Who's this again? The Hive Knight. Nope. That's good to know. Wait, that's the collector then. Who is this? Oh, Nosk. So that's the god tamer. Mm-hmm. This will be helpful to know. A lot of these bosses I just would need like a quick refresher on. Oh no. I know that one only too well. And there's more up here. Grim. So I'm assuming that Ascended Grim is the Nightmare King Grim. 
And there, this also means there are some bosses that I have not faced yet. Oh, no? That's not the same vein. Elder Who. Gorb. Oh, you can fight any boss ascended as an extra challenge. I see. So there's going to be separate pedestals here for the Broken Vessel and the Lost Kin, then. Oh, I, I remember Watcher Knight. It was annoying. Big Teleporty McGee. Well, this gives us something to chew on, now, doesn't it? Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. <laughs> For dream variants like Lost Kin and Nightmare Kin, uh, you, you dream nail the statue to change between them. I don't really want to fight Nightmare Kin, Grim, or the Lost Kin again. Actually, I kind of do want to fight the Lost Kin again. Just to see if he's actually easy now that I've got advanced equipment or not. Because uh, I, I was looking at the old footage and I'm like, now that I have the tools that I have, he might not actually be that bad. It may just be that I fought him way earlier than I should have. Oh, you know what? You're right. You're right. I'll kick butt. So where is the broken vessel located? So that's Hornet. The Fluke Marm. No, I don't want to fight the Mantis Lords. Broken vessel. Lost kin. Revenge. Let's fight Lost Kin again, just to see if he's as bad as I remember. I probably should have unequipped. I should have unequipped Quick Slash, it's really not gonna help me in this fight. Alright, well thus far it's going well. Okay, no, no, okay, no, he's easy now. <laughs> I don't fear you. <laughs> Alright, never mind. Compared to... It, li it must have just been uh, all the equipment. Oh, hey, it even has a little notch there. Alright, uh, let's try the Ascended. Let's see if this is, like, way harder. <laughs> I'm preparing for pain. Whoa! That was a crazy jump you did, bro. Actually, this seems to largely be the same fight, just... He's dealing more damage. OBS disconnected. I don't care. I'm gonna keep going. Oh, well, I died. <laughs> Alright, we're back. So, um, I lost the Lost Kin Ascended Battle. As you may have uh, guessed. OBS disconnected. I'm like, oh, I'll just continue fighting. He, he beat me. Changed my badge setup a bit. 
we're going to try him again. And I, I'm pretty confident we can beat him. So yeah, we unequip the Quick Slash. Okay, that was dumb of me. Whoops. <laughs> Let's try that again. <laughs> Let's try that again. Well, let's just try out that again. waiting for that. Oh, he changed his direction in the middle of the air. He was gonna land farther away, but then he saw I was in the middle and was like, no, I'll actually just magically extend my hop. Ah, we can, we can do this. I don't know how much HP he has, but uh, we were knocking him down pretty, pretty easily. So, yikes! <laughs> oh, lot! It's the lost kin. Yeah, but I'm not afraid of him anymore. Because we actually have the tools needed to deal with him. I'm just being dumb in this fight. Now, I don't know if we're going back to every single boss and fighting the normal and ascended versions to get the notches. That would definitely extend the stream by a good amount. I love... The badge that massively extends the range of your nail. It's so good. The Hero's Pride, I think it's called. I will actually heal myself twice. Just to take another hit. Like that. Honestly, it's those those orange guys that fly around. They're the bigger threat. Because you can't leave them alone or else they'll creep up on you. I hate how he can just change his trajectory in midair. That's kind of the one part of this fight that's unfair, is the fact that he can just change where he's going to land in midair to judge based on where you are. Darn it, yeah, those orange guys. They are the real threat in this this fight. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to use the Balder Shell more. Because I can enter healing mode and it can take the damage for me and get me out of a tight situation. That's right, now I remember why I hated this fight. It was the, uh, the wonky hitboxes and unfair trajectory. Wow, really? Uh, 
that's kind of ridiculous. This guy also definitely has more HP on the Ascended version. It's not just buff damage output, it's buffed HP as well. Alright, really? Really? Okay, this, this is getting a lot more annoying than I remember. Well, than I remember from the first uh, repeat fight of here. He just keeps dashing at me. Strike one of those stupid orange guys down, and then immediately another one appears. I don't remember... Okay, I don't remember that in the regular Lost Kin fight. It would at least wait a little bit before it would spawn a new one. This one is just like, nope, the instant you kill one, a new one appears. Which is highly frustrating. I'm starting to feel like I was doing better when I had Quick Slash equipped. Which just doesn't make any sense. Still don't know why this guy's being called the Lost Kin. He's no kin of mine. There we go. That's what I was looking for. There we go. We have conquered the lost kin forever. Now how about a prize? If you want the prize, you need to do that for every single fight in here. Oh, doggone it. <laughs> Why? Alright, well, longer stream than was expected today, but I think it was warranted, because, wow, we discovered a whole new world, and this whole new world is going to be interesting, so maybe we won't finish Hollow Knight this week. That's just a shame, because I love that nice, round, 30 episodes, but, you know, I'm gonna have fun in this area, which the same cannot necessarily be said for the arena, so we'll keep going. But again, we will be finishing this in August, one way or another. So, thank you all for tuning in. It was great chatting with you all, and thank you for your help in finding this area. We will be streaming again on Wednesday. It looks like we'll be continuing with this boss rush, boss rush area. We might fight more of the Ascended bosses, at least as many as I think would be enjoyable to do. 
And maybe we'll go around to try to find that missing mask shard and the remaining badges in the game. That will be exciting. Look forward to that next time. This was definitely a fun stream. Thank you all for joining in. Have a great rest of your night, and God bless everybody.